Hi everybody, it's Diana. A few of you asked um, how I got the little tea bag on this card and I did my tea bag a little bit different than Carrie did who I got um, the idea for the card. Um, she had some cute little heart punches inside to make her tea bag and I just used cardstock. So this is how I did it. I took a piece of very vanilla and it's two and a half by two and then I took a piece of the cardstock vellum, and that's the little bit thicker vellum, and it's two and a half by two as well. Then I took a piece of cherry cobbler, or you can use Cajun craze, um, whatever you, you want, but I use cherry cobbler. And what I did was I cut it a little bit smaller than the two inch, so the little, bit, little ditch or whatever before the two, just so it's a little tinier. And then all I did was I tore it, just to give it the look of like that there's tea in the bottom of the tea bag. And then I'm gonna mount it to the very vanilla. So I'm just gonna mount it up just a little bit like that. So you can kind of see that edge around it. And then I'm gonna take the vellum. Now you know you can see adhesive through the vellum. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a little bit on the top because the top of my tea bag is going to cover that. So then I'm just going to put this on top and it matches it up. So now you kind of get the idea of what the tea bag is going to look like. Then I took, I have this leftover um, cherry cobbler, my one inch punch. And I'm going to come in and I want about half of a circle. So now I've got my half of a circle, put a little bit of snail on there, and now I'm going to cover that spot where I had put the adhesive, and now you're not going to see that. So see, starting to look like a tea bag already. Then I took a little bit of linen thread, and I'm going to put that on there, and then I'm going to take my stapler, and I'm going to staple that down. So, kishunk, there you go. So then you have, this is now stapled to the tea bag. And then I threaded the little jewelry tag on there like that. But it needs to have the little corner like a tea bag would. So then I'm just going to take my scissors and I'm going to just make a little cut like that. So that gives it that edge. And if I want the same kind of, like, um, angle, take that little piece, now this is kind of small, but take that little piece that just came off of there and lay that on the other side. And it's going to be hard to hold because it's tinier. Usually you would do something bigger than this. And then when you cut it, you'll match that. You will get the same angle on both sides. And then that is your tea bag. Isn't that cute? And then again, I'll show you the finished card. So it just says, a morning without tea is like sleep. And then there's a tea bag in there. So it's pretty simple. So hopefully you've learned how to do a tea bag with the, the punches. And it was um, something you're going to want to try. Anyways, thanks for stopping in. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.